does with its teammate pushing up to the blue side. Here's the pressure coming in on Ben. They got three players on Ben backing down. There's one kill right there. This should be an opening for a blue Ben capture. You can just pick up the pieces here. UEG gonna land a pretty nice nade. There you go. I'm not even sure if you expected that one to hit, but it worked out. Shots in the bottom blue pit as well, and we'll get that. So UEG just firing on all cylinders here, man. Not really missing. Yeah, it's super important that that nade gets that kill too, because he's no longer having to focus on that player, and because right. of it, he's able to get damage onto another game with the sniper, but it didn't result in anything. I want to see him kind of pick up a couple kills quickly in order for his team to fly into the wagon. That's a couple of quick dumps. Next thing you know, they're capturing half the map here, looking to push up on Blue Bed, potentially push this into a trap. Yeah, the difference between playing guys like Renegade, Drug, like even Tolik and Soul Snipe at this point is if you miss that one shot, if you take six shots instead of five to kill a player, it can completely turn every situation that happens from there on it. And I think well, we just saw his Station 9 Legend. And, uh, honestly, I think I remember Shady going off with it as well. So they want to get that out of their hands and successfully done. Might be an opportunity for a cap if they don't lose their lives and they win these battles. Big battles going down here at red. It looks like ultimately he's lost his teammates. He's going to be forced to back down. But I like this from Peplu. He's doing pretty much everything he needs. Oh, oh my god, huge double. Precision, they both pick up kills. Uh, and with that, uh, or sorry, Super CC and the team all pick up kills. And there's going to be one alive to top the base. Slinky is going to do his best to try and win a one on one quickly. But a good job by this player, Sika to stay alive for as long as he can. Unfortunately for him, Slinky hit some incredible shots right there, and he's able to take him down. APMA picks up a kill. Now it's the four on two. Super CC is going down, but not without Slinky trading out the kill. And because of that, he's gonna pick up a double, and Slinky doing it all right now in the base, and that's gonna result in a flagpole. Two still dead, four legends. This is the game one of the losers finals on the line right now, and Super CC and APMH both pick up kills, which is gonna open up the map for Slinky to run this one. This is a godlike sequence from Slinky right here. Like, just from the start to finish in this life, he stayed alive, he got crucial kills on the base, and he literally won the game. Slinky, he hasn't really shot his gun here in the past few seconds. Everyone on his team, though, is winning gun fights, getting the kills they need, buying time. There you go, a kill goes in his favor, another double kill goes in his favor, Trip cap still continues on triple kill. Let's no. see if he can get the over Oh, no. baby, he gets the overkill, Damn. killing Frenzy. And that is a moment to rip with those. We're going to get an opportunity to see how good Soul Snipe is with these power weapons. He is going to shoot the last scatter shot, it looks like, drop it, and pick it Ooh. back up. Ooh, nice little YY there. 